I'm Eric Hilden, Career Placement Office here at Saddleback College, and today we're out here at the 22nd Annual Red Ribbon Resource Fair and Nonprofit Career Fair. And as a Career Placement Officer here on campus for Saddleback, I am in charge of putting on career fairs, job fairs, twice a year. I'm also in charge of giving students a connection to employers through the online job board called Gaucho Jobs. And today is just an exciting event. We have about 45 to 48 vendors, we have employers, we have resources, we have a wonderful array of uh, amazing people that students are linking with and connecting to. So I just want to say thank you very much for the continued support and students keep an eye out for future events and different career fairs so that you can connect your pathway to different careers that you're interested in. My name is Peggy Dakin. I'm Program Specialist in the Human Services Department in the Health Science Division at Saddleback College. Our Human Services programs have four certificates, Alcohol and Drug Studies, Community-Based Corrections, Mental Health Worker Certificate, and a Human Services Generalist. The purpose of our Red Ribbon function today is to bring resources and information to the students and community regarding prevention and intervention in the field of substance abuse. This is our 22nd year and it's always been very successful. We have some people that come year after year. Hi, I'm Rich Goodman. I'm an instructor in human services. I've been at the college for 35 years. Approximately 21 years ago, I became aware of the significance of the Red Ribbon celebrations being held throughout the United States. And I put together the present well, event that you're seeing behind me. Uh, we usually have between 40 and 60 different agencies that uh, participate. Many of them are in the field of alcohol and drug abuse, and our students who take our alcohol and drug studies certificate program have the greatest amount of interest, but it's open to the entire college. It's an opportunity for anybody on campus to meet possible future employers, to get questions answered about drug problems, things that are going on currently in our culture, and additionally to other job opportunities that may be present. The best thing about this for me is that many of the people representing these agencies are former students who went through the Human Services Department. So it's a particular joy to me to have them here as professionals working in the field. Mm -hmm. 